All right, this is Gabe White here on the report of Dushin's muscular dystrophy. Uh, description, DMD is a genetic disorder that's main effect is muscle degeneration and weakness. It's caused by an absence of dystrophin, a protein that holds muscle cells together. Uh, symptoms may be fatigue, learning dis difficulties, muscle weakness, frequent falls, trouble getting up, difficulty walking, breathing difficulties, and heart disease. Most kids are in a wheelchair by age 12. Location of the disease, uh, DMD is a sex-linked recessive disease on the X chromosome. Its synergetic location is on the locus XP21.2. That codes for the muscle protein dystrophin. History of disease. Its first account was in 1836, but it was formally discovered by French neurologist Guillemine Duchin in 1868. He gave record of 13 patients with the disease. Uh, little was known about this debilitating disease until the 1980s when it was formally named after him. Limitation of the disease. Signs of DMD often appear between ages 3 and 5. Kids often have a hard time walking and fall easily. By age 12, kids are usually in a wheelchair. DMD isn't very painful, but uh, but it significantly decreases their mobility. Uh, by the teen years, lack of dystrophin can weaken the heart and lungs, which can be severely life-threatening. About a third of the boys have some form of learning disability. Life expectancy is around late 20s and early 30s. There are some accounts of men living into their 40s and 50s. Treatment and diagnosis. Um, sometimes a doctor will uh, look at the family history, they may take a blood sample, and they may order a muscular biopsy, as shown in the picture. Treatment, there's no known cure for DMD, but uh, steroids are often used, and activity is highly encouraged. Inactivity can make the disease severely worse. Uh, the disease is inherited because it is on the X chromosome. That is why males have it much more commonly than females. Um, current research for the disease, uh, scientists are hoping to come up with something to replace dystrophin, and this would help protect the muscle from injury and promote uh, muscle repair and regrowth. Doctors hope that someday these potential therapies may be used in combination for maximum benefit. Uh, thank you. These are my citations. All right.